Banksy by Angelina Kimmons. Banksy is a famous street artist that was born in Bristol, England. He is anonymous and wishes to remain unknown, and he is considered a vandal, a political activist, and a film director. And he's been active since the 1990s. Banksy was influenced by a few people. Some are Marcel Duchamp, Diana, Princess of Wales, and Kathy Kilwitz. Banksy's pieces a lot of the time use stencils, and in the beginning he used stencils as a freehand element, but by the year 2000 he had turned to the art of stenciling because he realized how much less time it would take to complete a piece. This piece by Banksy is called Girl with the Pierced Eardrum. It was recently altered to depict what is happening in the world today. A face mask was added to his piece to show the effects of the coronavirus. Banksy has recently joked about how his wife hates when he works from home. In his bathroom, he painted a whole bunch of rats that look like they're trying to escape. And in the mirror, you can see that one of them is writing down the days. So it's similar to the idea of how we're all stuck inside our houses and we're counting down the days to when we could get out, similar to how people are in prison. Banksy made global headlines in 2018 because his painting called Girl with the Balloon shredded itself while being auctioned and its auction price was 1.4 million and the new name of the piece became Love is in the Bin. The slave labor mural was created in May 2012. It is 48.03 inches high by 59.84 inches wide and it shows an a child at a sewing machine assembling the Union Jack patches. This piece was created to protest the use of sweatshops to manufacture things for the London Olympics and Diamond Jubilee in 2012. In 2013, this mural was removed from its original location and put for sale in Miami. After an appeal, it ended up going back to the UK and it sold at auction in Covent Garden, London for 1.2 million. In 2015, Banksy used Steve Jobs as a subject of one of his pieces to highlight the refugee crisis. He graffitied the wall of the jungle camp in Calais to show the late Apple founder's background as a son as a Syrian. It is rare for Banksy to leave a statement about his piece, but for this piece, he stated, We're often led to believe migration is the drain of the country's resources, but Steve Jobs was the son of a Syrian migrant. Apple is the world's most profitable company, and it only exists because they allowed a young man from Oms. The issue of a lot of Banksy's artworks is that they get removed or destroyed. One piece called Spy Booth was created by him in Cheltenham, England. The piece critiqued the global surveillance disclosures of 2013. In 2014, bank robber London and Robin Barton tried to help with the preservation of the piece. They tried to have it removed and sold, but since it was painted onto a grade two listing building, it was prevented from being removed and ended up being destroyed or removed in August 2016. Another one of Banksy's works that no longer exists because it was covered is called The Gorilla in the Pink Mask. It was painted on the side of a Muslim cultural center in Bristol. This was one of Banksy's early artworks and the removal of it angered a lot of people. Sahid Ahmad stated that he didn't know it, the importance of the piece and thought it was just another piece of graffiti on a wall. Another well-known artwork by Banksy is called Love is in the Air, also known as Flower Thrower and The Mass Thug. It was first executed in Jerusalem in 2003. This piece is thought to be a contemporary update of a classic image from 1967 called Flower Power, which showed protesters that stuffed tiny flowers into soldiers' gun barrels. This piece, made by Banksy, 
It is one of his many artworks that show the favor of Palestinian rights. Banksy's artworks are so popular because of the fact that he's not afraid to show what's wrong in the world. His works bring attention to things that need to be fixed and that he thinks are not right, such as child labor and war. Some people do not know how to view Banksy. Some people only view him as a vandal, but his work is not just random things. There are things that are important that need to have attention brought to them. His work has meaning and it is to help people.